our journey starts in Yabugogo. Busy and chaotic, this area is a far cry from the tranquility found elsewhere in the city. Today we will be visiting Jabana, a slum located on a hill overlooking the district. According to locals, this is the very poorest slum in Kigali, and today we will find out what life is like for its residents. Make sure you like this video for the algorithm, and subscribe to my channel if you want more content. When I landed in Rwanda, they confiscated my camera drone at the airport, so I want to get to the top of this hill and snap some pictures of the city's skyline. We have paid some motorcycle taxis to take us to the summit, but things didn't go as expected. Suddenly the taxis stop and demand payment. They haven't even taken us one-fourth of the distance we agreed on. But I have to pay them six, six, six. Yeah. For that. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing we can do. We don't want to bring her to make shit. I give man. That's a scam. They, they didn't they say they would take us to the top of the that's, mountain? That's what I thought. But this is not the top yeah, of the exactly. mountain. Yeah, so exactly. Why would I give them that much? That's that's what I thought. That's what I thought they want to take us there. Up. If someone has come to you and already agreed, sometimes you know, there's nothing else you can do. Huh? The motorcycles leave and we continue on foot. Merry way. Hello. Yeah. What's the name of this place? What's the name of it? Huh? Jalana. As you can see, the village has good bones, and it's very cozy here. The only thing missing is paving for the streets and maybe some paint for the houses. Okay. How much do you think rent in a place like this would be? 10,000 Rwandan francs is just under $10. That's extremely cheap, even by local standards. Normal rent in Kigali starts at around $50 per month. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we can go up this way? Is your way? I think so. I think no way there. We can see now. Okay, you're right.
Huh? Yeah. Rukaka. Yeah, when it rains, mm. do areas like this flood? Yeah. Are these areas safe? Hmm? Are these areas safe or is there crime? Is there is this area safe? Yeah, it's safe. So they don't steal from the houses or anything like that? Yeah, they are like 90, 80% so before they are, the neighbors are used to it. Yeah, it's like a community. Slum dwellers aren't always as poor as you might think. This area is located next to Nyabugogo, one of Kigali's busiest bus stations. So many of its residents can earn a big income in the city with an unusually low cost of living here in Jabana. Miriwe? It is unclear if Kigali plans to upgrade this place or to demolish it. Mamutse. Maybe we can do some uh, interviews. Junior asks the local lady for directions to reach the top of the mountain. Oh, they have a forest. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty. Huh? Yeah, but it's not as bad as I would expect, considering they don't have sewage. Yeah, and how it looks. So, do the Rukarakara houses melt when it rains? Even this is Rukarakara, this is mud. This is mud. just freeze and put back there. Okay. Even Rukarakara is somewhat expensive, not all the people support. Okay, so then what's the difference between Rukarakara and mud? Rukarakara and mud? Yeah. Okay. So they use, they, they, they just first uh, put on the wood. Okay. And then they construct, they, they construct the woods. After constructing the, with the woods, they put mud. Okay, just mud, regular yeah, mud? Yeah, exactly, it's regular mud. It's not hardened by the sun or anything like that? No, 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 no. So when it rains, does this melt? They, they, no, they just put it there so that, it, 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 because when it's dry, it's like hard. Okay. So you can find that this house like uh, here like for 10 to 15 years. Really? Yeah. Wow. So what I'm thinking is that mm. the mud in Rwanda is, is better quality than most countries. Mm. It seems to be stronger. Cause if you I think it's the way people uh, uh, build the houses. Uh, it, sorry. No, no, not there. It's not there. Okay. So look at the look at the trailer. Look at everything. This is the way how poor people live here. Yeah. So you can see. So. Someone who has come to rent this place uh, is really... Maybe up here? No, there's nowhere there. Right close here. Mm.
Yeah. Do you want to hold this for a little? <laughs> Why not? No cookery monsieur, and your mom was sent as a young cook for Tora. No matter Jacques Shamarus, no, 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 we're just in the in the road. Yeah, it's public. Yeah, it's public. <laughs> this is why I need to lose weight. So here, yeah, this is okay. Okay, this is for good for you because we're losing weight. Yeah. Uh, you are breaking down calories. The kids being so friendly is good for the video. I can eat, are you getting now? You have to. Oh, okay. Let's see. Muramutse! Twice. There's a button here. Are oh, you holding it? No, click this. Twice. Yeah, one, two. Let me do it. Let me do it. Yeah, to stabilize it. Oh, okay. So they have uh, satellites here. Yeah, that's a lot of dishes uh, for TV. And they have internet. Uh, they have uh, electricity. Also. Electricity, yeah. All, all these places, all these houses, most of them have electricity. Wow. Yeah. And it's underground. Okay. Okay. Before, we used to have like ninety percent of, uh, eighty to ninety percent percent of underground cables. But now, due to that. Uh, uh, maybe, uh, maybe I, I, I think it's, it was a, the, 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 there was this problem about maybe like the way they used to install them in the underground. 
So when it, when it came to the rain season, there was circuit. Okay. So there was short circuit, yeah. and then uh, the the electricity used to 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 cut, to be cut off. So often in the, in the rainy season, so that's why they, they brought about. See, it, um, they started doing now uh, doing the what? Uh, uh, the up. So now the fish cables are above, just they're above, above the ground. So this is more convenient than before. So why don't people live on this side? Because of the rock? Yeah, so it, these are remote areas, difficult to, to construct on these remote areas. Now Neza. You say? Muraho is like a low. Muraho, uh, uh, you fine. Oh, oh, hey there. <laughs> is there anything to see at the top of the mountain? That's because you told me that you want to go to the top of the mountain. There's nothing much to see there. Just only the trees. Any animals? No, 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 no. <laughs> no animals. There used to be like uh, the low parts here, but no. Leopards? Long, yeah. They used to even to come the to come to the houses, uh, people's houses. When you were a kid, how long ago? I've heard the stories because Pascal was born here. They used uh, they used to see the ropards, and they used to hear them walking on the on the roof. Oh, wow. Sour.